would you say you were more an artist in painting and trying sure. to? Absolutely. And that was your path. So, yeah. like, did you really worry about like your future or mm. what you were going to be or anything? No, I, you know, I didn't for some reason. Um, sometimes the day-to-day -day thing, but I think I, just, I had an idea that everything's going to work itself out. Um, the acting thing, not really at all. I had a, I used to work at this place called Dr. Carl's Hog Hospital, and it was on Venice Boulevard, and. You know, I was I basically did grunt work there, and and I ended up in a fight with the guy who owned the place because of a pit bull incident where the pit bull had chewed sideboards of a hot rod in the back and turned into a fight, and I, I, and it just ended badly. And a friend of mine took me to a party up in the Hollywood Hills just to get drunk and get over it, and uh, I drank way too much. Ended up on a the second floor of this party and had borrowed someone's glasses and an arm was missing, these giant glasses, and started yelling at a bunch of people in the room. And it was, I, you know, I guess it was way over the top because I'd be like, oh, my secret identity. I was like doing this whole stupid thing. And uh, somebody came, this girl came up to me and said, hey, did you ever thought about being an actor? And I was like, leave me alone. And a friend of mine was like, who's that girl you're talking to? Which Ended up us going to the, you remember Damiano's on Fairfax? Yeah. On Pizza Place? Oh, yeah. It was right by Largo. We ended up there, and then the director for a play came, and they asked me, uh, you know, because I just lost my job. I was like, well, will I get paid for this? And I was an understudy of uh, a play called Maps for Drowners at the Tiffany Theater on Sunset. And you, had you had an acting class no, or a. No. You knew nothing? Nothing. But I was like, and, and plus it came with. You probably won't have to do anything because you're the understudy, right? And so I'd go to these, you know, rehearsals and stuff. And, and when you're an understudy, do you just watch the lead actor and just yeah. go? So you, you just try to learn the lines and you try to, you know, get ready. But you know, this, it was a young, good-looking blonde kid, and I was like, he'll, he'll never not show up. And and the first day, dude didn't come, and he just I, didn't show up. Yeah, <laughs> and I had to go out there, and I was, you know. And Lisa Kudrow was in the play, and I'm kind of up there just feeling it. And now, when you found out you were going on, do you, do you recall the way that felt? I wasn't crazy nervous, to be honest. I thought actors were like models. I didn't think they were like artists. You know what I mean at that point. But uh, that's kind of how I started. Hey, folks! Thanks for watching. If you like what you just saw, then why not subscribe? Click right here for lots more off camera, and. If you want to see the hour-long version of these conversations, I'm going to give you the secret link. Here it is, offcamera.com. Check it out.